Good morning, everybody. So we're saying hello to you from the beautiful Oludenis, Turkey. And we just managed to swap rooms. We've arrived around uh, 5 in the morning and we had a twin bed. So Matt was sleeping on one side of the room and I was sleeping on the other side of the room. So there were no snuggles whatsoever. So this morning we spoke to reception at Carbe Ho Carbel Hotel in um, Oludenis and they were very generous to actually um, send us to our favorite hotel and give us this amazing room. So Do you, is you, you want to explain a bit more on that? Uh, if you want to, yes. Yeah, basically we arrived, as Yo said, at around 5 a.m. local time, 3 a.m. UK time uh, this morning, and um, basically went to a hotel called the Carbell Beach, which is the sister of the hotel where we are now. Anyway, we were given a twin room, and we went, I said, uh, obviously, we're husband and wife here. Um, no, we, we booked a double, not a twin. And we were told, oh, well, this is the only one we've got, I'm afraid. Not to be perturbed, we said, okay, that's fine. Let's sort this out in the morning, because it's 5 a.m. We don't want to, obviously, stand here discussing it. We need to get some sleep and rest. Um, so we went to the, the front desk this morning after having an hour or two of sleep. And then, of course, before we did that, we actually updated all our customers all our clients, all everyone got their updates to their plans, uh, and obviously we went to the front desk and said, obviously, um, yeah, husband and wife, we want a double, and we don't want to be on the ground floor either. In fact, is there any chance that we can get moved across to our favourite hotel, the Carbell Hotel, rather than the Carbell Beach? And the answer was yes. Um, so I, they asked if. Uh, we would like to to do so and I said yeah uh, in fact I would love to do that and can we uh, up upgrade the room to the best room you've got and they said I, I think we can do that so they made a call uh, they agreed and for just 60 quid uh, for the week entire week they've upgraded us to probably the nicest room they've got yeah. at the car bell we're on the second floor Look at these. looking out into the courtyard but it's a lovely little suite, nice little flat screen TV, and of course it's very comfortable. So I needed to make sure my wife was happy and comfortable in her surroundings rather than the cramped little room that we were given initially. So for me, £60 for my wife's happiness is an absolute bargain. Yes, um, a little bit about uh, yesterday and Sunday. So Sunday has been a magical day, um, you know, coming first in athletic figure, it, it is the highlight of the year and uh, we did a little bit of celebration and yesterday obviously with the travel uh, we took a bit of a break from the diet and boy have I felt it. Um, uh, after competition if you go a little bit, um, you know, if you stray down the wrong path you're going to experience anything from indigestion to bloating to abdominal cramps. Um, so currently I've got constipation. So uh, today I actually went back to eating healthily, so I'm eating salads um, and things like that to start uh, getting things moving. Uh, we've been in town and because we come here often, people already know us and they follow our journey. So people were saying that um, so far, this is the best um, I have looked in a show. So I was very, very happy to get the feedback and to see... From my Turkish friends, that is, uh, the, the, the fr our friends. We, we say friends, it's literally people people we've seen year in, year out. We've been here every year now for the last yeah. four or five years. Yeah. So if you haven't been to Aludenis, you must come. Uh, it has the Blue Lagoon. It is a beautiful place. Uh, yeah, Google the Blue Lagoon and you'll see why we come back and over and over. It's a beautiful yeah. area of beach and uh, sea and it's, oh, it's, magical. It's, it's magical. Okay, so I'm going to unpack a little bit, uh, chill a bit and then go and spend the day outside. It looks magnificent. So, is there any future plans or...? I haven't yet made the plans. I will let you know after... Uh, after I go for a poo, <laughs> <laughs> so I can think clearer. <laughs> so, is there any plans for the next month or two? Or I will let you know, and everybody know uh, as soon as uh, the situation stabilizes. I got to 
enjoy, chill, relax, mm. uh, clear my mind. And, and your bowels. My bowels and have a, a clear <laughs> vision for the future. What I do know is that one thing I am not going to do is I'm not going to binge uh, eat. I see a lot of times people coming out of competitions and going completely crazy and also um, uh, uh, seeing people not not breaking the cycle of binging. It's okay to celebrate and have a good time post-show, uh, but afterwards go back to a healthier way of living because it's, it's your body and it's the only thing that you have to live with or in for the rest of your life. So it, it is your temple, it is your creation. So look after it the best that you can. So there's be, there, there will be no food abuses on my part I will enjoy the holiday, but I don't have to enjoy it. Uh, well, the medium of food exactly, all the time. Like, like sitting uh, breakfast, lunch and dinner with five plates. Uh, that's not going to mm. be me. When do you think you're going to train next? When, when do you think you're going to hit the gym next? Uh, as I said, after I had a poo. <laughs> <laughs> so sometime in the next few days, though, isn't it? I think. I mean, I, I, know, I'm, I, I know I'm itching to get back in the gym simply because uh, I love being in the gym. We haven't slept today. Uh, much and I'm aching all over from flexing on Sunday so probably if it's not going to be today then it's definitely going to be tomorrow so I'm going to be doing shoulders back uh, and I'm going to leave probably legs for Wednesday until the soreness is gone mm. once the soreness is gone I can go back and do what I need okay. to do okay this phone's telling me there's about 10 seconds of, of uh, space available so I Love you all and thank you very much for your support.